Hi everybody, it's Miss Alana and Little Maeve and Maeve and we are going to show you how to make a piggy bank. a piggy bank today. So in sessions you know that I love using a simple homemade piggy bank to work on your fine motor skills for a three finger grasp. Um, this is a really important grasp for getting ready to hold a pencil with a tripod grasp. So we really want to use these fingers. So using a piggy bank to put coins in the slot is a great activity for that. So today we're going to show you how to make your own, right? All right, yeah. so these are the things you're going to need. You can tell everyone that yeah. I broke a little line in the cap. Yeah, the reason why we're doing it is because ours got a little broken. So we thought we should make a new one. Okay. So we are going to use an old food canister. This one is obviously has no more breadcrumbs in it. We cleaned it out and it has a nice top. And we're gonna use some scissors and paper and tape. Now you could do this super easy and just make the hole on the top. So the parents do this part. We're gonna just cut a hole right on the top here. So I'm gonna slice a little hole right in the top and make a little slit to put the coins in. Okay, and you may want to um, round it out. Sometimes I make it a little deeper so that they don't have to push so hard. But, all right, if you just want to do that, that's it. You're done. Or, can you sit down, please? Thank you. Or we can make it a little fancier. So today we're going to make it a little fancier. We're done with our top, and now we're going to use this paper to cover it so we have a nice piggy bank. So what we're going to do is we're going to put this around. I'm going to mark where the paper is at the top. Okay. And we're going to cut on that line. All right. So this is where your student can come in and we can say, all right, we're going to try to cut on this line. So Maeve, do you want to try to cut on the line with me? Okay. Here's your blue scissors. Thumb it up. Good. Thumb goes in the small one. Here, why don't you do it this way so you can hold on to the big piece. You always want to make sure they're holding on to the bigger piece. Good. Thumb is up and you're going to cut. Good. Try to cut on the line. Good job. Maeve has gotten a lot of OT the past couple of months because she's attended a lot of sessions. So her cutting is actually pretty advanced for a three-year-old. Okay, good. Keep going. Good job. Good job. Very good. And stop. Excellent. Okay, so now we can take this paper and we're going to wrap it around. Now we need to make a loaf. Now we can use the tape. Okay, can you cut me a little piece of tape off? Uh, right. Not with the scissors. You can just use it and can you do that? She might not be able to do this, but it's always good to try, so you can let your student try to pull the tape and pull. Good job. All right, now stick it on right here. You're going to stick the paper on. Good. So it's definitely fun if you do this with your um, student. It makes it a little more, um, they have a little more ownership over the whole thing. So this is their piggy bank, which is nice. So we're just going to cover the whole thing in tape. Now, Mom, could I do some on the low side? Sure. Here you go. You can do some. You can take some off. Let them do it. All right. Now, mine is not completely done. Um, we're a little bit still showing on the back, so I'd have to cut another piece of tape. I mean, another piece of paper to cover the whole thing. But you can see, for the most part, you have a nice piggy bank. You could then take stickers or crayons and draw on the front. And there you have it. You have a nice little piggy bank. All right, babe, can you put some um, coins inside of it? Let's see if it works. Good. Put the tape on. Good. And now put a couple coins in. Does it work? Push it. Yes! We made a coin bank. So again, now you could write um, your child's name on it or put stickers on it. What do you think, Maeve? Should we write your name or should we put some stickers all over it? Let's do stickers and write my name. All right, sounds good. All right, so just have fun with it.
Bye. Okay, say bye to everybody. Bye. Bye. Enjoy.